Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 300, uh, nope, Sims 3 Rotational Play. We are here with the Punch family, and I just have to say, I'm a little thrown off. So Judy is getting up because she's getting sick, as we all know, they tried for baby, and she's pregnant, so she is expecting, and she's gonna get sick. What? Please tell me why VJ Alvi is sleeping on the couch in their bedroom while they're in their pajamas in bed together. Ah, <sighs> VJ. No wonder why you didn't want to be Lisa's best friend. Oh, he has a thing must be for Judy. Who knows? Okay. So, Judy, go ahead and get sick. And then we're going to get you back to bed. Okay, he is gone. Like the wind. And Judy is back in bed. So there we go. She does want to buy a dishwasher. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick for her. Because uh, it's something she needs, I think. Um, this, uh, I can't. This is, mm, 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 mm. Ooh, buddy. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I'm out of words. Is uh, is not cute. That's what it is, okay? It's not cute. And that's all I can say. I don't, I can't find any other words about this kitchen. No other words will be found to talk about it. All I gotta say is I can't wait until I make some renovations because the things that irritate me like this kitchen are going first. But dishwasher's been bought. Now she wants to buy a tree house. This lady just wants to spend all her money. She goes, okay, they're gonna tax me, spend all my money so I don't have to pay as much in taxes. I've got a hundred kids. Give me a hundred more and then I'll really get a refund. <laughs> okay, so... Um, the only place I could really put this is in the front yard or I'd have to move... I guess I could put it here. Right? That works. I think so. It says, due to a water leakage problem, we've decided to shut off the water. <laughs> this means that any plumbing related objects will no longer work. Apologize for the inconvenience and we'll work our hardest on fixing the problem. Um, now we don't have any power or, like, or water. Okay, something's not right because these are still working, dude. What the heck? Can you guys go somewhere so we resolve the power outage and all electronics devices should be able to work again as expected. They were working the whole time. Unless it doesn't say that we could use them like this, but like if they tried, like they just waved their hands or something. I've never tried. I don't know. But um, yeah, it was, it still acted like I could go down and like turn the TV on and start watching TV. So I'm not really sure. But that's okay. No, no, you're not. No, you're not. Put your clothes back on and get in the shower. It is not time to go out and play in the treehouse right now. It is time to get ready for school, Arlo. What is wrong with you, dude? Oh, we just received some tax re... See, that's what I don't like. I don't like the tax return because that doesn't make sense because they're going to... I'm going to do taxes myself. So I'm going to calculate it and then what they get at the end of that, either a refund or not a refund, is like if they got a tax refund or if they had to pay in. Um, so if they're getting tax refunds all the time, then what I'm going to do isn't going to make any sense. And so I don't know. I don't know. If you guys have any suggestions about that, let me know. Otherwise, I might just take that part of this mod out because the rest of it seems good. Though we should try... If it tells us, like, there's going to be a power outage or whatever, we should try to use some kind of electricity and see if it actually is working or if it's, like, it's, like, broken and it's not physically working. And then it would, there would be really no point to having this mod. So they resolved, oh, well, that explains it right there. It says we resolved the water leakage, which means as of now, you'll be able to use all of the plumbing objects again. But we just took a shower. So how does it make any sense? That doesn't make any sense. 
I don't understand. If anyone has any um, info on that, please let me know. Please let me know. All right, so Judy has to go to work, but she's pregnant. So, like, her staying in a job is going to be, like, slim to none because she's going to be having a baby. So, time is limited for her. But I'm pretty much just having everyone have a quick meal today. Also, he does not have a degree. He did not graduate from university. I'm actually going to delete this. Can I actually do it? No. There we go. And delete. There we go. And I'll also get rid of this. There we go. So he doesn't have that mood line anymore. And she doesn't have a degree. These guys obviously don't have any. Oh, wait, he does. Oh, my goodness. No, you don't, dude. You haven't even finished school and you think you've got a college degree. Come on. That doesn't even make sense. You can't get a college degree without finishing high school first. Or at least, like, getting a GED. So, good try. Now she wants to buy a washer and a dryer. What the Alicerno? What the heck? Um, did someone just blow up our bird? Wow! What is your issue with my flamingos, girl? That is not nice. You don't need to kick over all three of my flamingos and then run off. Disrespectful. 751 simoleons? <gasps> oh, my lanta. That is a lot of monies for bills. <laughs> don't worry about it. Just get rid of them. <laughs> oh, my gosh, Ethan. Oh my goodness, Darlene. Go to school. Okay. Nobody wants to, like, get an A or anything, so. Doing it. He wants to read a book about street art. Why would you want to read a book about it? Wouldn't it be more fun to actually do it? I don't know. Guess so. Guess not. I don't know. Alright. Buy a washing machine. And then, I'm just going to want to buy a dryer right after it. Where's the washing machine? Here. Nope, that's the dryer. Oh, my lanta. Alright, we're going to put it, like, right here. Because I don't know where else to put it, honestly. Uh, we'll put this here. Okay, well, now we know that when we go back in, she's going to want a dryer. So, we're just going to go right back in, and we're going to get it. <gasps> she wants to get in a promotion. Oh, hot diggity. Locking. Okay, so what does she need to do? She needs logic. We also need to chat with our partner. No, uh, work hard, I mean. She needs logic, though. All right, we've picked up our flamingos. Looking buttes, looking buttes. Um, why don't we read this, dude? And then you can also recycle it. And I feel like there's another paper under here. Clean that up. And I think that's it. I know that vampires don't like the sun, but you know what? Jack has got a, a job and he needs to do it. So he's going to do it, all right? He'll be fine. He's got three hours. Um, he's just disposing of a couple dead plants. It's not going to kill him. He's going to be just fine. Don't anyone, fr don't anyone panic. Don't anyone panic. The kids just don't care about school. <laughs> Honestly, they're just like, okay, another day. Another another lesson. Nice shoes, Jack. Nice shoes, dude. Yeah, go, Jack. It's okay. <laughs> We're gonna plant new. We're gonna plant um, lettuce and grapes and apples and tomatoes. We're gonna lock the back gate. Is there a back gate here? I thought there was a gate there. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Maybe it's over here. Was that it? No. How do I know where the gate is? Uh. Maybe there isn't one. 
Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Oh, the llamas. The llamas and your mamas. Alright, so he wants to get pumped. He also wants to train someone. Perform the school cheer. Is that not what I'm doing when I click on him? Does anyone have any suggestions? Is practice school cheer not the same? Do I click on the floor? No. How do I perform? What's the difference between perform and practice? Ooh. I'm going to have him try one more time because I'm really thinking that it should work. I might also be crazy and just not know. Why could I drag this but I couldn't... S oh, I can't sell a diploma. What's wrong with me? Let's put this over their bed. Jack sleeps on this side. And Judy normally sleeps on that side. That's good. These guys are all good in the hood. Okay, so he's performing. Garbage, garbage. Oh, garbage. Did it work? <gasps> nope. <laughs> okay. I got excited. Alright, so now we gotta get pumped and we also gotta train someone. And that just means we need to go down here to the gym. It only looks like there's two people here. Okay, not a lot of people here. And until we use a workout piece of equipment, I'm not going to donate money. But if we end up working out ourselves on a piece of equipment, then we have to. Um, if we're just training someone, which is what I really came over here for. If we're training someone, then I'm not going to make him pay because it doesn't make sense. Technically, wouldn't you be getting paid? You know? So. Alright, so let's see if we can train... Who is this? Styles? No. It's, um... Yeah, it is Styles. I was totally right. Why didn't I... Why did I second guess myself? Offended. Alright, Jack. I also gave him a lot of body hair, because I don't know. I just see Jack with, like, a lot of body hair. Maybe I'm wrong, but whatever. Wow. Just wow. School just gave me detention over something I didn't do. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> She's got to stay until 2. That's really cool. That is cool. She's got an A. He's got a B. So he wants to see Lisa age up. Ooh, he wants to learn the gardening skill. I want to do that because I want to have him learn it so he can grow plasma fruit for himself. You're coming up, buddy, and you're getting a makeover. Because we're tired of seeing you like that. But I'm going to get a picture of these two. Alright, buddy. You really get at him. Going to get a picture, guys. Picture time. Oh my gosh. Look at his face in the mirror. I got it. I got to get it where you can see his face. Priceless. Alright. I can't wait to remodel these lots. I know I say this every episode, but I really can't wait. Dude, I really hope you're not working out in those shoes. The boiler room. The school's boiler has begun to break down and somebody needs to fix it. However, the school's budget is already running low and they can't afford a professional repair technician. You can fix the boiler before it stems or steams over. The school will pay you for your time. Your school performance will also increase. Of course we're going to do it. Vixen. Who is this? Cullen, get out of my face. These random generated townies are so up my butt. Schoolyard chums. Uh, the school counselor made an announcement on the loudspeaker this morning to inform all students that a buddy system is being encouraged. This new buddy system is to reward students with who behave, who develop friendships with fellow students. You should become Raj Alvey's friend to improve your school performance. Of course we will. Of course, I will. Alright, Jack's carpool is coming soon. So, Jack, you can stop, dude. Leave, leave Styles alone. He's heard you yell at him enough. Stop taking photos of me. God, I've had enough of it. Go to work. So they can leave you alone. I feel bad. It's all they do. Aw, Emma's here. I love seeing all the Sims running around town. It's so fantastical. 
Your time's coming up there too, Jocasta, and you're going to get yourself a little makeover. Who's this? Fiona? Beautiful Fiona. Simis. Yours too, buddy. Okay, Cyclone and Simis are not getting along. They are actually arguing to the point that they're in like that angry stance. Oh, did he slap him? Oh, whoa. VJ's coming home with Lisa. BJ, you didn't want to be my best friend forever, but you want to come home with me, bro? That ain't cool. Michael's coming home with Ethan. Isn't she coming home at two or something? Oh, so she's got the same schoolyard chums thing that I just read, but she needs to become friends with Mirage Alvi. Isn't that who he had to become friends with? Yeah, they both have to become friends with him. Okay, they're going on a field trip in their favorite rocket ship. Oh my goodness. Who was that? Someone was like booking it or something. Oh my goodness. Another leakage? Come on. She got out at 2. But look. He's already like. Oh wait. He gets out at 2 as well. I don't know. Why was she in detention then? How were you in detention if you didn't even stay after? Now they're getting along. They're talking about his daughter. They're talking about um Bella. Redonks. All right, she needs to get her logic up, and I don't think we have a way to do it at home. So I am going to take her over to the library, because I'm pretty sure the library, there's a chess table. Is there? Chess table, oh, chess table. What is up with all these tourists and things? Black market gnomes. That's just in... Uh, there's a well-established gnome smuggling ring, and they're meeting at the business office. Get there quickly to listen in and gather intel so that the criminals can be brought to justice. This could be a career-boosting move for you if everything goes well. Yeah, we can do that. Let's go do it. Let's just go do it right now, after work. I don't like that hairstyle at all. I think it is really, really horrible. Just saying. No... Not saying if any of you guys have that hairstyle that, it, you know, it looks horrible on you. I just don't like it in The Sims. Just, like, the line just looks so bad. Okay, Judy made 239. That's great. He's off to work. And Lisa is fixing the boiler still. These guys are going home. And they both need to become friends with Mirage. Oh man, we didn't visit the graveyard last night because she wanted to do so at a during a full moon. Though, why does anyone go, hey, I really want to um, go to a graveyard when all of the zombies could eat my face? I don't understand. Okay, so we need to become friends with Mirage. And we'll try to do that. The kids are like, get me inside, it's raining. I liked her with the little boots. I don't normally put boots on them, but I just really liked it. I thought it was cute. Guys, there's like seven doors to get in the house. Please figure out how to walk up the steps to get into the home. Thank you. <sighs> Where's Mirage? I guess we could try and talk to him a little bit, maybe. Chat with him on the phone. Can we have them both chatting with him at the same time? Is that even realistic? <laughs> stadium cleanup. The rival team just came to town, and as usual, the visiting fans left our stadium in absolute disaster. disaster. The owner insists the stadium be cleaned by tomorrow, and your coworkers are pleading for you to stay late to help out. You'll earn real points for sticking around to help. Of course we will. Lisa's carpool is coming, and the water problem was resolved. She's talking to Michael. I'm going to let it happen. Because I don't know how far off they are in age, and maybe it could be a thing later in life. So I'm going to let them just talk while he talks to Mirage on the phone. Also, let's go ahead and chat one more time, because that's what we're going to do. And she needs a shower. She's probably not going to go to work tomorrow. She's going to find out she's pregnant tonight. And he is at work. He's working overtime until 11 now. So that's an... Unfortunate, kind of. No, you were supposed to go to work. Oh, wait. It's just two hours. Okay. Let's get her a bath when she gets here because she really does need that. 
Okay, he's still talking with Mirage. They're not friends yet, though. 26 over 65. And she's going to play with the blocks. But I do need to have her become friends with Mirage as well. Okay, so she gathered the intel, I think. Go to work to complete this opportunity. I don't know if she's going to get that done then. Get inside. Don't worry about getting inside. Worry about getting home. Also, we're going to make this self-cleaning when you're done. Because you don't have anything else to do. You do want to pillow fight with Artie Page. But he's not even your friend and he doesn't like you. So, we're not doing that, obviously. <gasps> She's finding out. She is finding out. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wait and... There we go. Gotta get a picture. I gotta get a picture of this. Priceless moments. I love how it's in the middle of the rain as well. Like, she literally got out of the taxi to go, okay, gotta get my first bump in the rain. <laughs> Jumps out to do it. Jumps out of a moving taxi. <laughs> okay, so she's not going back to work for, like, a really long time. Um, which is fine. It's fine. We don't need that money that bad. <clears throat> but. Uh, kind of do. We kind of do. She also wanted to get a promotion. But, like, we can't do that for her. And now she's probably going to get a lot of baby wishes. And, like. Brr, we'll see her, like, be pregnant for a thousand years. Because, you know, we pause the pregnancies and such. So. It's going to be interesting. All right. So he is good, and he is good. Oh my goodness. Bounce the crowd. The owner of the local theater could use your help in managing the crowds that are expected to surge through for the upcoming events. Get to the theater soon to manage the crowds with your muscular abilities, and you'll get paid handsomely. Sure. Um, can we do that now? Work as a bouncer when you're done. She's off to work, so we're not going with her. He needs to still become friends with Mirage. So let's chat with him one more time. And then I think we're going to have some pizza. Eat some pizza. And let's have um, Darlene grab some pizza as well. I know she's playing with the blocks, which is all good in the hood. But I need her to, like, you know, really be trying to uh, keep up her needs. I'm also trying to encourage maybe getting out of the like doing the um the blocks so maybe she'll try to like do her homework or something really you just took off the pants and put on shorts okay i mean i guess this is so loud stop it and the sims 3 music is copyrighted as we all know so we don't want that in the background all right good to know to good to go i mean not good to know um okay ethan made 90 simoleons day which is awesome and do i have the wait do i have the mod where they can have banking accounts in this game because like he should put his money in his banking account you know the kids so they have like a little bit of money to move out with eventually i don't know okay so he's finished with that so now it's her turn to no stop it with the monsters bro oh not that call mirage and chat with him it took your brother like a long time so hopefully it doesn't take you as long but now that they're friends it's good now we complete we can complete that tomorrow when we go and he'll be good to go when he is done eating he can do whatever until bed but it won't be long before i send him off to bed and then Judy, well, if she finishes that, I don't think she will, but we'll just say she does. Well, she can eat some pizza and head to bed because it's getting late. Go to sleep. Oh, Jack has got to work as a bouncer still. It's going to be a really long time. And then he's here talking to Michael right now. Um, what are they talking about? Get to know. Okay. Is that his work attire? Interesting. Interesting. 
And she's working. I paid all my taxes, but now I have nothing left. Um. What do you mean you have nothing left? Weird. He's presiding over the royal boy. He's having a bunch of fun. He just he's living life for the fullest. He's only got ten more days to do it, so might as well. It'll end up being more though in the long run, you know. Let's go ahead and chat with him again. This person, this Cullen Maynard person, is so obsessed with us. It's ridiculous. It's disgustingly ridiculous. What is this? Um, she's halfway done. I'm really shocked. She'll be able to finish for sure. And he got something to eat while he's at work. Lisa made 81 simoleons. Okay, these guys are done. Can you stop it with the radio? I swear to... Oh, they do have a chess table. I didn't see that over there. I don't know why, but I didn't. Okay, we actually need him to clean these up. Because I'm not... I'm not doing this. And then... Let's do... Another one of these. We'll put it right there. Actually, you know what? I want to put it back on this floor. Because I just think it makes more sense. Okay, she's home. We're going to get her some pizza as well. I think it's getting late now. Yeah, it's going on 10. So when she's done eating, she can go to bed. Oh my goodness, VJ is playing with the dollhouse upstairs. All right, you can go to bed. I think 10 o'clock is a good good birthday or good bedtime for them. It's 10 o'clock. I think that's pretty good. He's the oldest. Ethan is. So I feel like he should be able to stay up maybe a little bit longer. Um, let's do one of these. And I want to, like, get rid of that. I also want to get a photo of him doing this because I forgot to get a photo for the last episode. And this is one of the things that he did in the last episode was this. So because I record them back to back, I'm just going to go ahead and grab a picture of them doing this real quick. All right. Fancy. Okay. He might not be in the same clothes, but it's okay. I don't think it's really that big of a deal. All right. I'm just going to play through the end of the day because you guys know me. I never get off when it's time. Serve dinner. Make up some autumn salad. Okay, more rocks and metals. Like, this thing needs to be, like, turned down a little bit. It's a little too fast, I think. Random occurrences should be random and very far and few between. But we've got, like, all these rocks still inside. Like, it's so much. Oh, my gosh. Michael and VJ are here, and they're just doing their homework. Okay, he's still at work. If he's, like, at work or whatever, I'll end it, but... Mainly waiting on these two. Oh, she finished that. What does she want to do? Hire a maid? Uh, we're not transforming. I want to date with Jack. Oh, that'd be cute. Hire a maid? Absolutely. You guys need it. Okay, where is the phone? Here it is. Go ahead and services. Call for services. Oh, Come on, dude. You gotta finish, because you're gonna make the salad. He made 455 simoleons today. It says, your coworkers are incredibly grateful for you for sticking around. It's like you rose in their eyes for helping out, so perhaps the extra hours and stress were worth it after all. Um, let's see. We want a maid. And he got a promotion to minor leaguer with a bonus of 684 simoleons. Minor leaguers are calling, so pack your lucky socks and never wash shorts and head to the playing field. It's important to keep your teammates' feelings in mind. Remember, there's no I in team. He now makes 75 an hour from 3 to 9. Okay. No. You're going to come eat. Go here. Bro, we hired a maid. 
Seriously, some of these things are not completing, and that's really annoying. I know you're tired, Judy, but we're going to get you fed first because I don't want you to be really hungry. Wait. She is insisting on going to bed. She can wait. All right, go ahead and grab a plate. You're going to grab a plate. How many more murals does he need to do? Want just one more? Okay. Come on. Everyone's aging. 24. Still says 24. Oh, there it goes. Okay, 23. So now we have officially made it one more day. And they are one day closer to aging up. Go to bed. And I don't care about any of that. There's a water leakage again. Oh my gosh. It's like the third water leakage since I started playing this tonight. Put away the leftovers and head to bed. He's out doing that, so I'm not going to worry about it. When he gets done, he can come home and go to bed. But he's going to be doing that for a while. He's off to bed, and the rest of them are in bed. So that's going to do it. We only have one more day with these guys. It's just Tuesday, so we are not going to see Judy give birth. Um, but I will pause her pregnancy, and when we come back, we'll see her give birth. But yeah. So if you guys are enjoying this LP, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell so you get notified when I'm uploading. Also, please don't forget to follow me on all my social media sites, which are linked down in the description below. And follow me on Disc or join the Discord so you can see my schedule. And then follow me on Twitch because I stream there again. So yeah, that's all my things. That's a lot to say, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will talk to you guys in my very next one. Thanks very much for watching.